Welcome back to Bubble Pop Kids. Chopping Block is ready. We have six new squishies to test. Yes, cannot wait for this. Actually, four of them are squishy balls, but I think they're filled with different things just by the texture and feeling them. I don't know. I think we're going to be in for some surprises. So what do you guys see we start? We have a kick off the shell with a rubber chicken. A rubber duck kind of looks like a turkey. It feels exactly so gross like the chicken when all the feathers are plucked and it's ready to cook. It's bumpy and slimy and it's got a pretty blue eye. Seriously, the coolest texture of a squishy. So, so sticky. My finger sticks to it. The best part with this thing is when you squish it, ooh, look at all of that. There is some milky stuff in there. Looks like an egg. I just do not know what to say. Coolest, coolest thing ever. Here she is, everybody, the season one famous Shopkins Cheeky Chocolate. This is actually a squishy stress ball. <gasps> it is so, so squishy, I love it. It looks like chocolate, it's making me hungry. I already chopped up cookie cookie, so now it's time for Cheeky Chocolate's turn. We're gonna see what's in there, what color it is, what kind of material. Poor little guy. We have one of these, and not only does this feel so, so cool, it's got the coolest texture. I don't know what's in there. Are they Orbeez? Are they rubber balls? And yeah, so this is my first glowing one that blinks. We are gonna find out what is in there making it do this. Awesome. Moving along to the back row, three more squishies to test out. We have this one here. Now this one is really a super mystery. I don't know what is in here. Feels amazing. I've never had one like this. Kind of molds and shapes, but it's crunchy. Listen to the crunch in there. This little squish is all purple and glittery inside. It is mesmerizing. It looks like the galaxy. Oh, that's going to be a good one. <coughs> Ew, look at this thing. This humongo red blob. I kind of have a feeling what's in here. It's so, so heavy. Feels like it's two or three pounds. Super squish. Probably the squishiest thing on the testing table. I could do this all day. Figure that one out. And the sixth one is this. When I look at this, it looks like a tennis ball. Until I start feeling it, it either feels like jelly, I don't know, but it's so crunchy and slippery, slimy at the same time huge mystery. The time has come. We are doing this, guys. And like I always say, sorry, I'm like a broken record. If you guys want to do this at home, just make sure you have an adult or parent supervising because we got to use some sharp, sharp scissors and just don't do this alone. Let's get started. First victim on the testing table is this guy. Look at this. Ew, look at those little chicken feet. They look so gross. He's got these wings. Pretty much looks like it's ready to go into the oven. Yeah. Yeah. I first laid eyes on this beauty here. <laughs> I thought it was just a rubber chicken. I've seen them for years. But then I felt it and there was definitely something inside, really squishy, and it popped this thing out. It looks like an egg. It looks like an egg yolk. It's got all of this milky stuff in there. So what do you guys see? We get our shishas and start cutting them up. Inside of here, there's definitely some kind of liquid. It looks like maybe some white glitter or sparkle juice. And there is like a rubber squishy ball in there. So I have a cup here so we don't make a mess. I am so used to making a mess all over this table. Just gonna pop it. Ah, I'm so scared. Oh, ah! Oh, ew, there's more. Ew, so gross. Chicken juice. Chicken juice. Blah. Ah, little chicken doesn't pop anymore. Nothing comes out of his butt. But inside of this cup, it looks like we cracked an egg. How crazy is that? Little egg yolk. 
strange substance. I really don't think it's water. Maybe it's kind of like glitter water. It's kind of a milky color. I don't know what that is, but when I've cut open other splat balls, it was clear. This definitely isn't clear. Looks so, so cool. I love it. And there is a little eggy yolk. Ew! So, so slimy. Might as well chop this up too. Ooh, wouldn't it be so, so funny if this had gel inside? Nope, it is just the craziest rubbery material. Kind of feels like the yellow chicken material. Boop. Scrambled egg. Yeah. <laughs> of course, we gotta go another step further. I'm just gonna chop this chicken's neck off. I think it's just hollow inside. Ooh, it feels so weird. Flip it inside out. actually does flip all the way inside. I can't get it off. It's like a little balloon. <laughs> and there you go. Mystery of the rubber chicken is solved. Inside was some of this. Looks like real egg yolk. Actually could not look more real. Was amazing. And this super hard stretchy rubber. Ooh, it's got a little plastic inside. Weird. Woo! That last one is going to be hard to top. So, so crazy. This one looks a little bit more normal, but it's really, really cool. It's so super squishy. Kind of looks like there's some kind of a sand or powder in there. But when you squish it, it actually feels like jelly. Weirdest thing. heavy and when you throw it doesn't have too much bounce it's just like a dead weight it sinks but my guess is I don't know I'm thinking it's some kind of a powder in there maybe mixed with a little bit of water or gel let's find out here it goes and I'm gonna use my ultimate pinching technique Ooh, that whatever's in here there is a lot of it it just feels so so heavy and snip a little piece from the side. <gasps> you guys, I think there is some neon yellow sand. <laughs> it looks like sand. What is that? Maybe it's like kinetic. Ah, so, so cool. It's like we're emptying out a tennis ball. Woo! This is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm in search for. Every time I cut open a squish, I want to find something so different. And I think I finally found it. Ew, there is some yellow. Looks like galactic colored neon sand. So soft. It's definitely not kinetic sand, but it's more powdery than regular. I don't know. Maybe it's a mix of flour. Coolest thing ever. Ooh, there's more. Yikes. Ew, and this sand smells like super glue. It's got a super strong smell. Maybe that's like the dye they put on it, but unbelievable. Who would have ever thought to put this inside of a squishy ball? Most genius idea ever. Flip it inside out. Ooh, it's got all this sand there. Looks like a rough day at the beach. <laughs> so much. Gonna be vacuuming. And I don't mind. I love this. So cool. Woo! Here it is. Mystery of the yellow ball is solved inside of this hard plastic. It's really super hard. It's not too stretchy. We get this yellow sand. Ah, had to take a little break and clear the sand. Ooh, it's in my eyes, my ears. That stuff is flying everywhere. There was like a pound of sand in that ball. Super cool. And we're moving on to... A cutesy little cheeky chocolate. Hey right, guys, time has come. I'm gonna chop up cheeky chocolate just like a real piece of chocolate and see what is there on the inside. And instead of doing the pinch corner trick, I'm gonna go right through the center and see what we have. 
like a piece of chocolate. Wow, I am so surprised. Inside a cheeky chocolate, we get this brown, super squish, foamy stuff. And now there's two, you could share one with your friend. Kind of looks like a Kit Kat bar now, so it's so funny. Really, really squish. I kind of like them like this a little better. Woo! Best way to describe this is on the inside, it looks and feels like a piece of chocolate cake or cupcake. It's got that kind of fluffy feel like a piece of cake. It doesn't smell like anything. Sorry! Sorry, my little cheeky, your little cubes of chalky now. Sorry, little cheekster, for chopping you up. Let me take your arm and your foot. Look like a little piece of cake now. Well, I'll slice that little chalky up real good. And this is what we get inside of the cheeky chocolate stress reliever. Some kind of squishy, fluffy, looks like chocolate cake. Kind of like a memory foam. Looks yummy. We're on to squish number four, and this one looks so, so cool. Not only does it look cool, it flashes and it lights the night away. Look at this squish. It looks like a jellyfish. Oh, it's so, so bright. What could be in there that is flashing this super bright light? We gotta find this out. So, so cool. Crazy. that thing shine. It is flashing away. It's the strangest thing. These kind of feel like Orbeez, but a little bit stronger. I don't think they are Orbeez. We have this little thing in here. It looks kind of like R2-D2. It looks like a little robot. And the super stretchiest rubber ever. This is so cool. Alright, time for the pinch corner. Little slicey. Ooh, oh, they are so cute. Ew, look at that thing. <laughs> it's so big. Tons of these little rubber bollies. Whoa, but more than these things, we're going to chop those up soon. I don't think they're Orbeez. They are so, so cool. We got to look at this. So, so wild. What makes it start blinking? I don't even need to... Oh, there you go. <laughs> Got a little disco ball. Here it is, right in my hand. This is the mystery. <laughs> the mystery I was wondering about. Unbelievable. This thing is so cool. And actually, you don't have to slam it down to get it started. You just pinch it. I don't know if it's better like this or inside of that ball. I think I like it like this. Little night light. Woo! Such a great find. <laughs> I've never opened up a squishy with anything like this on the inside. So, so cool. I love it. And get into these little things. There's so many of them. Oop, there's a few more. Pop them out of there. Ooh, this is like the craziest material. It feels like a jellyfish. Back to these things, these cute little rubber ones. They are so amazing looking. They kind of look like little gummy candies, although they are not. You definitely cannot eat these. They're like teeny little bouncy balls. Could have been Orbeez, but they're definitely not. Let's give them a little slice. Ooh, got a little crunch to them. Ooh, that one has a little bubble in it. <laughs> Let me try the pink one. Such a cute color. Looks like jello. Here it is. Now the mystery solve of the squishy thing. We get this rubbery, super, super stretchy plastic. Ooh, I love it. Ooh, broke. <laughs> and this little light up ball, coolest thing ever, with these little bouncy ones. Can't believe it, I have another one here. And this one, besides that rubber chicken, is the one I've been wanting to open up. Ever since I got it, just listen to it. It sounds like Captain Crunch. Oh, I love that sound. Super relaxing. Not only does it sound so good, it looks really good. Inside of here, there is purple, 
They look like little crystal or jelly rocks. Tons of glitter. And I love how whenever you move this around, it just kind of shapes like a piece of Play-Doh. So moldable. So weird. This would be perfect for like a little cat that likes to do this. The things they do with their claws. They'd play with this all day. They'd probably pop it. Sorry, I had to squish this around as much as possible and play with it before we destroy this poor little thing. And I don't know if it's just purple rocks inside or if it's like a purple kind of rubber. But we're gonna find out soon. At the corner. Chop, chop. Ah! Wow, what is that? They feel like little purple stones. <gasps> they are beautiful. They look like jewels. Oh, I think we struck some kind of treasure with these. Look at these beauties. They're so weird. They're filled with some kind of a slimy oil. And they're filled with glitter and shine. Ooh, kind of looks like caviar. Those little fish eggs but super pretty ones. This by far is the most amazing material. <sighs> Ooh, but whatever's in there is so oily and greasy. I have a mix of like grease and purple glitter on there. Such a weird combo. Wow. We hit the squishy jackpot with these. Whoa, <laughs> my mind is going crazy. Such an unbelievable find inside of here. This is so relaxing. You could just do this all day. And inside of here, oh, it is filled with this greasy, oily stuff. I guess it's to make the beads or little rocks kind of slippery in there. Kind of a purple color too. We did it! We found out what was going on inside of this crunchy purple ball. We get all of these little crunchy poos. Love them. I couldn't be more happier with what's inside. Amazing. All right, my little bubble pops, we are on to the sixth and final squishy ball. Ooh, just listen to it. This thing looks so freaky. It looks Scary. It looks cool and awesome at the same time. It's like a big blob. It's so, so heavy. I actually saved this one for last because I think it's going to make a huge, huge mess. Whatever's in here, there is a whole lot of it. And I don't know what it is. kind of think I know. Let's see. Thing is red and shiny and it is waiting to get sliced into. So I got my scissors. I'm going to chop it. Ooh. There is a little hole in there. <gasps> you are kidding. It is Orpheus. Yes. Looks like the poison apple in Snow White. It's got the little things flying out. <gasps> Amazing. <laughs> I don't think there's as many as the happy fees I cut open, but this is good. Look how many are on the table and it's not even halfway spilled out. Oh, this is going to be crazy. Ew, it feels like super glue. that enough mystery material for you? Mystery solved inside of this red balloon. We get thousands of Orbeez clear ones. They are soaked in some kind of glue. Ooh, they're slippery little ones. Boop. 
Get out the excess, still a few left. Pop them on out of there, Ew. Ugh. <laughs> so gross. There's more, if you can believe it. That's how I like to do it, saving the best for last. Such a cool surprise. Super huge mess, tons of stuff in here. Love it. And at the end of the video, this is what we have. We started with six little squishies we could play with. Now we have this giganto mess and I loved every minute of it. We got some of these little perpy things, some sand, tons and tons of Orbeez. I loved this. <laughs> Whatever that was looked like an egg and our little cheeky chocolate cake. We are gonna have so many more fun videos coming up on the show and if you wanna subscribe to our channel, you could just click this big yellow bubble with the bubblegum machine and subscribe. You guys can also leave me a comment and let me know what was your favorite squish here. Have a great day, bye.